It's that time of the season where we have the level 27 league specific prime players pack And we also actually surpassed seven wins in the weekend league so we have some decent rewards So sit back get a broom and enjoy I am going to heaven. I'm giving you a win. There's no need. Right, welcome back to another video on the channel where we've actually played beyond seven wins. We have, I believe, 10 wins, which gets us three player picks and all of these packs. So it makes a change. And we really need the coins. Right, Neymar, Cruz, Barella. Realistically, we're probably going to get none of them. But let's just open the first one. One of five as well. So the selection always on. Uh, David, Sané. Let's go. Oh, Sané's actually quality. This card, I, I, I mean, two are weak foot, no one cares. This card rinsed me in fit champions. He can play on the right as no left as well. These uh, I mean David's decent enough to be fair. Five star weak or oh, to be fair. If ever in doubt, foot bin is around. David's 10k. Sane is 38. Right, I mean I know how I'm taking David's still a very good shout. We probably will get David in one of the two player picks next. So no need to worry. Right, on to the next one. Neymar. That would be the dream. Salas, that's decent. Um Sane again. Yeah, not bad little selections. I mean, Silas is good. He's right wing back, which is very strange, but he can play literally anywhere on the pitch. Right. Danny Arons is raving right now. That's a very nice card. Right, last player pick. It's been all right. Sane's, Sane's a very decent uh, a very decent card. Tulam, he's one of the featured ones as well. I mean, that could have gone a lot worse. Sane's always very nice. I was rocking like a half fine team the other day. If you did want to see, this is what my team is looking like. We did have like Delict and stuff, so Sane would have fit in nicely, but like, Mason Mount's been quality for me this weekend. Uh, there's no real reason to like swap him out. So um, yes, I mean, on that topic, let me know who your best card has been in the weekend league. And also let me know who you've been packing lately. I'm pretty sure the latest screen team is not the best. Speaking of packs, we do have the League and Nations SBC. I forgot to even do this. So I thought, wait, why the hell not? 55k pack as the end reward. They're all untradeable. Yeah, no, it's fair to say we're going to be getting a lot of duplicate and tradables in this video. But, mate, we send it anyway. We don't even give a shot, mate. Uh, that's untradeable. No, that's tradable. That is big. Starting off with a 50k pack. And if we could smash 50 likes. Yeah, that would be much appreciated. Walkout. It's going to be a scream. Come on, English. Tony. Now, this card slapped me in the weekend league. And I'm telling you, mate, he scored like four goals against me. So, I'm happy with that. Ivan Tony is a decent pull. That's tradable as well. He's like 50k. That's a very good dynamic image and a very good card. Very nice. Pulisic out. I haven't, I haven't seen him yet. That is very weird. I got spit on my screen. I cannot speak. Right. That's a very good start to the video. Realistically, my goal today is to get like a very, very big pool. I'm thinking like a Van Dijk, uh, you know, Salah, KDB, the same old Premier League players, really. Um, packing people like Hakimi as well. That would be massive because that, I can sell him and get like 40k back. There are some options on the table to improve the team because people's teams may even... Ha I've seen Harden like literally every game. I'm wondering how people are packing these cards. That can rise. Again, I hope packed them this year. That looks really weird. Ronaldo's a come. Oh, team weak in there. It's not too bad. Yeah, mate, like, I've been playing against Ronaldo's most games as well, and I'm thinking to myself, mate, are people spending their money every weekend, or are they just super lucky in packs? Like, it's one of the two. But we, I thought I played some decent FIFA. Gameplay last night was particularly smoother and quicker. It's so weird how times alter the pace of the game. Um, uh, Wow, what, wait, what? As I was saying, it's so weird how different times of the day impact how smooth the gameplay is. I, it just sums up the servers, really, doesn't it? Like, also, the Travis HD Fantasy Football League, we have 18 members. Uh, I am sick with Tyler Kearney at the top. Well done, mate. In the week, obviously, because so many games were, like, called off, I forgot to use my wild card, and so many other people just used it. Obviously, wild cards, when you can do unlimited transfers for one for one game week. Everyone used it in the weekend. Now, mate, we're lacking now. We're lacking. We've dropped, like, 50 points at least. Right, these are the foot champions. Champion playoff packs never ever get a good return from, but Varane would be nice. Good easy, good easy. Pletcher, a team of week, that's not too bad. Um, the bling ball, that looks disgusting to say the least. Players are cheap this year, like it doesn't really mean a thing now. Like SBC players are the way to go. If you buy a player off the market for your team, that's considered like quite rare now. That's actually kind of crazy, right? That's what the transfer market was originally for, and now it's just for fodder. Weird, weird game. I can't imagine this game in like five years, to be fair. The top dogs such as Haaland, you know, Tushka Many, you know, all the future ballers, Foden, they're gonna be like 100k max. Like having their normal gold card is gonna be considered bad. That's how deep this game is getting into SBC cards and promo releases. Anyway, Jamie Vardy, 85. I haven't really heard much of uh, about Vardy this this season. Still 85 rated though. I mean, he's always been a quality player. Nine Golan. Right, the 55k pack and 50k pack untradeable. 50k pack first. Right, 12 players. That's not a walkout. Michael. No, I don't want to see you. 55k pack, and it's not a walkout. This is why. 
I didn't do this League of Nations. Speed and nothing else really to shout about in the pack. Right, I'm going to open the premium team of the week pack. Now, obviously, we want to see Neymar. This is tradable, so this does make up the coin balance. Very, come on, Spain. Goalkeeper. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's 30k, so yeah. Right, the ultimate pack now tradable. This is big. Icon or foot hero or a scream. It's, it's probably going to be a scream. It's not, it's a gold. It's not in a walk out, I, 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 I don't think it's a walk out. Oh, no, it is a walkout. Trap. Right. I mean, yeah. I mean, do we count that? I don't think anyone can be under this, right? No. Carver Howe. Uh, it's not over yet. Blah, 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 It's not over yet. We've just completed marking matchups now. Because a lot of packs are actually untradeable this year, it's encouraging me to actually get rid of duplicate fodder. So, um, I'm actually doing marking matchups now on a weekly basis. This is a rare occasion, but the packs are tradable. It's, like, you never know. They're probably, they probably will be better than my foot champion rewards, knowing the logic of this game. Small gold. It's going to be a board. It's not a board. It's Ericsson. Right, I don't know why I thought it was a board. I mean, he probably should be a board. Come January for the, um, for the upgrades. Also, the World Cup game mode. I haven't even, like, really thought about it. Obviously, it got access released on uh, PS5 the other week. But yeah, like, there's a, like, there's supposed to be a whole promo and a whole different game mode coming out for that, which will be exciting. That's like four weeks away, by the way. That will come around very quickly. So yeah, I'm guessing a lot of people will play that game mode. I'm like, I, I, like, I am wondering if it will kill off on the team early, early. I'm looking forward to something different, to be fair. And the World Cup in the window is just, it's weird, but it's the first one ever. I guess it's kind of cool at the same time. Now, finally, we have hit level 27. We opened this last year and we got a double bubble. You go by the names of Ruben Diaz and Bernardo Silva. However, we have the three options. It's quite obvious I'm going to take PL Prime players back. Although, Ligan's a very good shout because Neymar is currently in the team of the week. The walkouts, there are a lot less, so it's more likely to get a baller. But we always go PL Prime. No matter what. Prem's the way to go. Haaland, Salah, KDB, Van Dijk, the list goes on. If you did make it this far, comment Tiago. Right. Tiago Prem players back. Come on. Man. You can't do me dirty here. Level 27. That's a lot of like division rivals. Calm. The four. The storm. It's a walkout. Haaland. Brazil. Centre back. Tiago Silva. True say out really a drink up, but I got love for Brandy like Ray J. I mean, it's a walkout. That could have gone a lot worse. Yeah, I mean, it's not quite Harlem, but it's essentially a free pack and we got a walkout. On that note, is that? No, no, no. That, 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 that's pretty dead. Right, let me know if you have opened any of the free level 27 packs and until next time, boys. A bit. Now I've got no coins for it in for me, but I'll settle for Callum Hall. Oh, but I can't wash my hands. No matter game. how much it winds me up, I just can't pull myself away. No matter how much it makes me rage, FIFA's just in my DNA.